David Morella versus Eidos Yerbusinuli. Who do y'all think is going to win this fight? Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So, uh, yeah, to those who don't know yet, this fight is scheduled for 12 rounds in the super middleweight division. David Morel will be defending his regular WBA super middleweight title in this fight. Fight will be taking place this weekend, this Saturday on the 5th of November, November 5, 2022, live from the Armory in Minneapolis, Minnesota, USA, to be shown live on Showtime. So tune into Showtime if you want to see this event. It's a good fight. You don't want to miss it. Tune into Showtime. So anyway, uh, to those who don't know who David, David Morel is, he's a 24-year-old fighter from Cuba. Now residing and fighting out of uh, Minneapolis, Minnesota, USA, has uh, grown a fan base over there. I mean, he's been fighting there multiple times already for the past uh, year, uh, fighting three of his last fights over there at the Armory. And uh, it seems like he always sell a good crowd over there. And now here he is fighting uh, in his eighth professional fight against Eidos Yerbusinuli. A fighter from Kazakhstan, the same country where Triple G is from, 16-0 and 0 as a pro, 11 wins coming by way of knockout TKO. Yerbusi Nuli is coming off a win against Lennox Allen back in September of last year. Uh, he hasn't been that active, I don't know why, I guess he was just waiting for this moment for this fight to happen. And now here he is, um, fast forward basically a little more than a year, now fighting David Morel. He, this will be his fourth time fighting in the US? Third time fighting the US, he fought here in the US a couple times before. Uh, but for the most part, most of his fights took place over in Kazakhstan. I mean, he's been all over the place. He fought in Australia, Russia. Uh, what country is that? Minsk. What country is that? Let me Google that real quick. Minsk. Belarus. Ah, uh, I'm not familiar with the Belarus flag. So anyway, uh, he's coming off the biggest win of his career against Lennox Allen. Uh, somebody that David Morel actually defeated back in 2020 gave Allen his first loss back in 2020 in just his third pro fight um and now here he is you know uh fighting Edo Sirbusinuli so I always thought David Morel was is one of the most underrated fighters out there in the world today a lot he doesn't get that much recognition um in my opinion he's the he's the most underrated fighter uh in or around 168 um and I think come fight night in this fight the way I see this fight playying out is, you know, I see it being more of a chess match. I see it being more of a boxing match. Both fighters really thinking in there. Um, Ados is also a good boxer. He's he's not a bad fighter. I mean, there's, he's undefeated for a reason. But because of the inactivity, I feel like that will affect him in this fight. I think uh, Morel might be a little bit too fast for him. I think Morel will be beating him to the punch. Um... Ados tends to have, you know, he, he's a good boxer, but I feel like for this fight, for him to really pull off the upset, he has to start the body early. Try to slow down morale um, early on, but uh, I don't know. I don't really see Ados doing that. I see Ados um, you know, trying to pick. Both of them are going to be thinking in there, and in my opinion, morale is just a better boxer between the two. I think Ados really has to put on the pressure in this fight and really rough up. Morel if he wants to win it because if he decides to box if Ados decides to box Against a better boxer. I think Ados will will lose this fight convincingly But if he roughs up Morel try to get in the inside rough him up work the body early on Then I, I could see Ados possibly pulling off the upset win um, But it's gonna be a good fight it's going to be a good fight. I mean, Eidos is somewhat also underrated. I feel like not many people know who he was to begin with before this fight. Uh, but, it's you know, this is his moment. This is his opportunity to put his, na his name out there, fighting on Showtime uh, in the main event. Um, and, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. But I, I think most likely, I think Morel will, will win this fight. Mm, by decision, nine rounds to three. Nine rounds to three. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.